Thank you very much, Anne. One thing Anne forgot to mention, and because we celebrated Statehood Day two days ago, November 16th, what Anne forgot to mention was that her grandmother, who was born on a homestead near Norman, Oklahoma Territory, as a young woman rode on horseback from ranch to ranch and farm to farm with a petition asking for signatures to lobby Congress to make Oklahoma the 46th state in the Union. Therefore, Anne, I not only want to thank you, I want to welcome you home to your roots. I'd like to thank two co-conspirators who I think are probably mainly responsible for my induction this evening, Lee Allen Smith and Henry Zero. I'm most grateful to you, dear friends. Uh, you were a great cabal and you did a great job of railroading it. This is a very special evening, and I knew it was going to be special, but I didn't know I was going to be brought to tears so, at least twice this evening, so moved by music. We're very delighted to have as our guest this evening, and she's also here for her friend Leona Mitchell, the great opera singer Marilyn Horn. I got to stand next to Marilyn. I was moved to tears the first time when I stood next to her as we sang the national anthem. And the second time this evening I was moved to tears when our own wonderful, great Leona Mitchell gave us the gift of her voice and her music and we're so proud of her. She has represented our state so well for so many years. I want to thank the Oklahoma Heritage Association for including me among this very distinguished group of honorees. I am truly honored and truly grateful to you. I'm very grateful to my five sisters, my one brother, all my nieces and nephews who have given me love and support for many, many years. I want to thank my husband David and our children Carrie and Dan for the love and support they, and support they have also given me. In thinking about exactly what I wanted to say tonight to express how much I love this state, what I feel about it. I don't think I could improve. I decided there was no way I could improve upon the words of Oscar Hammerstein. And about 10 years ago, my dear friend Max Weitzenhofer used this quotation, so with apologies to Max for my plagiarizing, I'd like to quote those words we all know. And for every Oklahoman who is an Oklahoman, either by birth or by choice, we know we belong to the land, and the land we belong to is grand. God bless the great state of Oklahoma.